Are you one of those people who are scared of PNC and probability? Most GMAT students I have talked to are definitely scared. When I show them these basic concepts, they get confused at the first stage. Let me show the same to you and I'll test you on these concepts. If you pass this stage, then I'll show you another. So here I'm going to show you four statements that you just have to tell are true or false. Okay, so your time starts now. So four statements coming back to back, read them, mark them true or false. Once you're done, I'll show you the answer. Okay. I hope you have your answers here. These are just formulas, really. We don't have any solving here. What do you do if both will occur, if A or B will occur? Again, here also both and here A or B. So two out of these are correct. This is the next hint I'm giving you and two are false. I hope you have your answers now. These are the correct answers. The two with the blue smileys are correct and these two are false. If you got all four of these correct, then my next thing is, were you 100% confident in your answers? If yes, good. Your concept stage is already halfway there. There is a lot of extra nuance there that you have to take care of. But yes, you know the basics. You know what to do when there's an and between events or what to do when there's an or. But if not, you already know you need help. If you're ready with this much, let me show you the next stage. So now I will make you apply the concepts that you saw in the previous slide, the AND and the OR concepts. So both of them are based on the same situation. Three people are starting to write a book and these are the probabilities with which they finish writing that book. So my first question is the probability that Beth and Abe both of two people finish it. Now, if you know how AND works, it's a very simple application for you. You can multiply and get your answer. Question two, also another very simple application, probability that at least one of Beth or Carl will do it. So this time there's an OR. And if you know how OR works, you will again be able to apply the formula. This is the formula and you will be able to get the answer. But now I will twist it. These basic questions can be turned into something very interesting when I combine stuff. So here's a question for you. Look at it and tell me if you feel confident in solving this in under two minutes. Now the sheer length of this is scary for a lot of people. Forget about solving it. You first have to understand what the question is even saying. There's an added layer of the book being published and then probability that Beth or Carl but not Abe. So that's another layer of complexity. Does this scare you now? The confidence that you had in the conceptual stage, do you feel the same amount of confidence? If it has shaken a little bit, even then, don't worry. We have got you covered. I bring this session to you on advanced topics. We'll do probability and permutation combination here. A lot of focus on that so that you can go from a 600 level to a 750 level in just about an hour. What we'll do here is you will learn how to solve 700 level questions in under two minutes. Time is the key. It's not just about having unlimited time and getting it correct. You will be under time pressure there. We will first recap concepts because your foundation have to be rock solid. Once your concepts are there, then we will build on that and learn how to apply them. Now, all the good stuff does not end there. There are free resources as well. What you will get is this. First thing, 80 plus questions on just these two topics, PNC and probability. So you do the session, you gain confidence, and then you go back and practice these questions. Then there are a lot of video lessons for you. So 25 plus hours of free video lessons for anybody who would like to try these. 400 plus total questions. So go outside of these two topics and you want to test yourself on any other topics, we have topics. We have questions for you there as well. And then these sessions that we keep doing for you, seven plus webinars for you. Now, nobody would want to miss all of this. So I'll just remind you where you have to come. 9th March 2022, 7.30 p.m. IST, 6 a.m. PST. I'll see you on the inside. Happy learning.